as of this evening, uh, they're still investigating the shootings that started over the weekend. And although it's unclear at this point whether any of the shootings are related, we talked to some neighbors in these areas uh, who tell me that they don't feel safe where they live. Gun violence is leaving some Bull City residents reeling after at least eight people were involved in a string of five shootings. Three people were shot in this one neighborhood near the Oaks at Northgate apartment complex in the area of Lednam Street and Leon Street. Police say one man was injured on Sunday. Then on Tuesday, two men were injured overnight. One of them died. Sometimes I feel scared. I feel scared when I walk out the front door. They say when you walk out the front door, your life on the line. Jamal Scarlett reacted to the violence just after it happened in his own neighborhood in East Durham today, where police say a man was fatally shot in the area of Holloway Street and Bry Street Tuesday morning. This comes as Durham police say they're investigating a homicide after one man was shot and killed in the same neighborhood on Saturday. Do you feel yeah. safe here? Nope. 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 After living in the neighborhood for several years, safety is a growing concern for Jesus Romero, who lives just a few hundred feet away from where the violence happened recently. Every time when I, I, I uh, go to my room, we let the dogs out, and then they let us know. So, so that's why. That, that, that's the only way we can feel safe. And so, as mentioned, again, these are all uh, still under investigation, especially the two incidents on Lednam Street. Police say that uh, they're still in the early stages of it and can't say at this point whether those two shootings are related. However, we do know so far that a total of three people are dead. Reporting in Durham, Cindy Bay, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.